hi there small business owner my name is John I'm from Young Digital Group uh, we develop innovative online marketing campaigns for small business so that they can improve uh, sales and marketing systems and today what I wanted to quickly talk about was mind mapping in a previous um, video I discussed using um, keyword research so tools like Market Samurai or keyword AdWords tool um, what I want to talk about today is then, all right, well, how do you then determine um, what you write about in terms of mapping out uh, headlines, actual content? So basically, um, I use a program called MindMeester, and that's a mind mapping um, product. It's something I pay for, but there are free versions of other mind mapping software out there. I like uh, MindMeester because it's um, you can share it with other people. It's an online, it's a cloud-based uh, product, and you can allow other people into that service, and you can share that mind map online, and you can collaborate together. So, what is mind mapping? Well, it's where you start with the basic idea in the center, in the middle. What is that main idea? And it could be that it's just your blog or your marketing. That's that's your idea. And then you branch out from that and it's a key area. So if we look at say what I'm doing, um, we have uh, marketing is the main section and then we maybe you know, branch out into video marketing. Maybe another branch would be podcasting. Another branch would be Facebook. Another branch would be Twitter. And then from each of those branches, you start branching out again. And so you create this somewhat of a spider web of ideas and information. And this is where you can put in the keywords that you've just done your research on um, from the keyword AdWords tool um, or AdWord keywords tool uh, or Market Samurai. And it just what it does is it gives you that ability to map out, to plan what it is that you could talk about for the next uh, week or month or even 12 months. I know um, of some people that map out a full 12 months of what they need to uh, talk through just because they've got so many ideas. And by mapping it out, you then have a, a good structure to work with. So rather than sitting there and thinking, what am I going to write today? Well, you've got a plan. You can always refer back to your mind map. So the idea is start with your central concept. What is, what is it you're trying to achieve? Then branch out from there and name everything that then relates to that. And maybe you could even break it down into your life, your family, your money, your house. And what you're breaking it into is sort of major categories and then you break those down. So how does your product or service relate to each of those areas? And the more you then branch out, the more you can then niche down into a specific area and then you can follow that topic um, and really explore that concept, explore that idea. And then when you communicate your message through your blog or videos or podcast, Twitter, whatever it is that you do online, then you're referring back to the mind map. That's your basic plan. Now you can export that data and you can put it into, say, a Word document if you like, and you've actually got um, that step-by-step -step process. So it starts with the main idea, the concept up the top. Then uh, each little branch that comes out underneath that is underneath those, um, you know, those key concepts. So... Uh, my recommendation when I meet with new people to discuss what they want to do online, after having determined what it is they do and the problem they're solving, uh, we work out a bit of a plan and we do that by mapping it out. And the best way to do that is mind mapping. One of the pro products that I use is MindMeester. So go and check it out um, or look up any mind uh, mapping software uh, online or even as simple as writing it down on paper. Put your idea in the middle of the page and then branch out from there everything that you think is relevant and then interject all the keywords that you've just done all the research on and you can even highlight the ones that perform or you expect will perform better so you can focus on those. Alright, so thanks for watching and stay tuned for the next video. Um, uh, but if you need help on uh, developing your own online strategy, your marketing strategy, how you engage with people, how you become visible online, get in contact with us now for the details are below this video. Okay, thanks for watching.